want to know um, how much the laws in terms of... Um, <laughs> I mean, just quickly on the British press um, that are um, forensic in their work. I think that's a, no a nice one. Yeah. 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 Um, and frenzied. They, are, they don't let up. But they are more intrigued by budget um, than natural security. And we, I think it's the first time the sponsorship plus ticket sales um, doesn't even match up to the security budget um, in London. And there's no doubt that they will um, be looking for every angle they can find, but no Olympics hasn't come under a forensic eye with two, three weeks to go anyway, and every Olympics has had its bugbear in the run-up to it all. Um, you'd hope that the senses are that one thing, once things get underway, um, that will probably fall by the way. So an interesting Seb Co last week said um, the, br the press have made them a better organisation. And I thought it was a really interesting angle um, to take. And he you said... Were saying this at a press conference? Or privately? Said, he, no, no, yeah. <laughs> if it was private, it's a little late for that. <laughs> but he, he said it in public. He said the press, the British press and the press in general have made London 2012 a much better organisation than it would have been. We'll see you tomorrow uh, morning uh, for the next day. Sorry, you wanted to...